What's going on everybody, it's the Indoor Hunter, and the other day during a live stream, we had a pretty successful hunt over on Medved, and then we decided to transition over to Yukon, and this is where the problems began. In the end. Oh, this is interesting. I don't have slugs on me either, it's my only semi-auto. Make sure we don't have any diamonds with them. Listen, fellas, we can work this out. It doesn't have to end poorly for you. I don't like the way you're looking at me, buddy. die <gasps> oh yeah we're gonna die <laughs> come on give me those heart shots there we go that is an absolute giant that's what we came here to find, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hope we don't get kicked. That is a guaranteed diamond, 283 to 337. That's one of the biggest estimates I've seen on Moose in a very long time. We're right where we want to be here. No, 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 no. I don't want him to turn like that. It's a hit. But he's not there he goes there he goes i was gonna say he's not going down it kind of worried me a little bit especially after that last incident we had with the other moose just again because we're multiplayer it makes me so nervous that somebody's gonna get in here either kick us or something's gonna happen we got to get over here to him this is gonna be a very quick i'm gonna pick him up taxidermy him take a picture and then we'll probably review from there make this quick that dude is huge 289 oh my goodness there we go there's a five medium planes bison ladies and gentlemen here we go 185 to 202 that is definitely a diamond Problem is, we're 400 meters out. We've got the 7 millimeter, but we'll get the job done as long as we don't get kicked, of course. So, where the heck are they going? They're at a trot, so they're definitely. Yeah, they're, they're running now. Darn it. Good news is, bison are slow. If we can, the tactic now may to actually be trying to actually physically catch up to him. Where'd he go? We just gotta find him now. There he is. There he is. Now, if we can get right up next to him and point blank him with a 7mm, that, that would work out pretty nicely. At this point, I don't know how successful we'll be trying to wait him out. If I had the 300 on me, I'd feel more comfortable taking like an on-the-move shot, but I, I don't want to run the risk of we've got two chances to make a good hit, and I don't want to make a bad one, you know? Got stuff running past me here. The wolves are moving in now. This could be our opportunity, though, if we find him. If he runs right past us, this might be that time. Problem is, it is dark out here. And I just... I never saw him. Never saw him. 
Alright, I ain't got no time for your crap, Wolf. Like finding a needle in a haystack right now. And now they're just seemingly stuck. Just got murked out. There we freaking go. So the original spot that we had found him was just up here and we chased him all the way down here. And what a journey this has been. All right, he's at 200 meters. We've got the 300 now. Learn from our previous mistakes of just not having it. And he's perfectly broadside. We're gonna go ahead and take that shot. He just went aggressive, which tells me we did penetrate lung. Yep, he's going down. The only downside now is we're going to have to go all the way around this stupid lake again to get at him. He's finally down, though. That took us almost two hours to locate him. Man, and I was literally about to give up. I even said it. I was like, this is the last time change. Man, that what a crazy roller coaster ride that was. You know, it'd be really painful if he somehow went in the lake and started floating back across. I'd cry. All right, there he is. He's a diamond, 187. He's a pretty big dude. My goodness, what a journey. Let's go ahead and taxidermy him. I mean, we're in multiplayer. It's been good for the past two hours now, but you never know. Holy wow, that took so incredibly long to find. Now the tracking distance says zero because oh, we kept losing it. And just to kind of recap what exactly went down... When we first joined this session, roughly hour and 45 minutes, two hours ago, uh, spawned in here, came down to this lake, saw nothing. I was actually looking for wolves. Happened to spot some bison moving across this ridge line here. Boom, five medium. Tried to get in on them. Of course, the wolves came in, spooked them all the way down here. So I started chasing him down. He came all the way down here. And then I became server host of the session, and I decided, okay, his need zone's probably at this lake, so easy peasy, right? And change time, lo and behold, he wasn't there. Turns out he was here this whole time. But what's strange is I had already checked this lake once before. There was nothing there. I came back to this lake thinking maybe he's late again. Maybe he got spooked. I don't know. 
Rick's joined the search. We searched all around this area and we just got lucky and there he was. I don't know why it took us so long. I mean, I threw every trick in the book that I knew. Um, that just goes to show when you're in that situation, especially if you're in a single player map, uh, what you need to do is actually not chase after the animal, follow his tracks backwards, find a need zone, and then hunt that need zone because it'll save you two hours of searching. Uh, in the end, I'm glad we did it. I was about to give up, but uh, it was successful, so I'll take it. That was one of those... Um, it's not fun in the moments, but when you look back on it, you're like, all right, that was pretty cool. I mean, we chased it literally, I don't know how many kilometers we walked trying to get this guy, but worked out.